Hey guys, this is the first video in a series I'm going to do explaining the tips and tricks of War Z. I'm starting with a fundamental basic, the health, hunger and thirst bars. This is the health meter, it's indicated by a silhouette of your player. Here we have the hunger and the thirst bars. We'll start with the health meter. As you can see in the diagram, your current health is indicated by the red filling of the silhouette. Once this reaches the bottom, your player dies. There are multiple ways to prevent this from happening by healing yourself. The five ways of healing are shown in this clip here. We have antibiotics, bandages, painkillers, bandages DX and medkits. Not all of these solutions heal for the same amount. Bandages and painkillers heal for the least, whereas antibiotics, bandages DX and medkits heal for the most. Always ensure you have means to heal yourself. These are more important than food and water, which I'll explain why in a minute. Next is the hunger bar. The hunger bar decreases over time, but will decrease faster if you're sprinting. The icon will turn red once you're getting low, and the entire bar will turn red once you're completely empty. When you are completely empty, you will slowly start losing health. This is why healing items are more important, as you can effectively live just by healing when your health drops. To refill your hunger bar, you must eat food. However, some food will regain more of the bar than others. Small foods, such as a bag of chips, instant oatmeal and granola bars will barely make any impact on your hunger bar. Whereas tin food, such as a can of pasta, a can of soup and cans of tuna, will redeem much larger portions of the bar. Next is the thirst bar. As with the hunger bar, this will slowly decrease over time and decreases faster while sprinting. The icon will also turn red when low and the bar will turn red when completely empty. Again, as with the hunger, once thirst is gone, you will slowly start losing health. To refill your thirst, you must drink fluids. Drinks like a can of soda and a small water bottle will redeem smaller portions of the bar opposed to drinks like juice, large bottles of water and coconut water. However, you should be wary of drinking energy drinks. They may redeem quite a bit of your thirst, but they also take away a small part of your hunger bar. There is one caveat to this, an item called Bag MRE. They can be found in game, but also purchased on the marketplace. Eating one of these will redeem a massive portion of your hunger and thirst, almost returning both to full from empty. The last bar that I haven't spoken about is the sprint meter. It's the orange bar that surrounds the others, activated when pushing the sprint key. You only have a limited amount of sprint, but it will regain slowly whenever the key is not pressed. As mentioned previously, sprinting causes thirst and hunger to decrease faster, so should definitely be used wisely. I hope this video helps you out, and I'll see you next time.